In Figma, creating interactive prototypes is actually pretty simple. The process starts by adding interactions between different frames in your design. Let's take a look at how this works. Let's first go to the Prototype tab in the Properties panel. Now you can start by selecting an object in your design that you'd like to be interactive. This could be a button, an image, or any other element, including the frame itself. Once selected, there is a plus icon to the right of your selection. You can now drag it to another frame to indicate where this interaction should take you. Once you connect the interaction noodle to a new frame, you'll see the interaction details window. You can choose the type of interaction you'd like to add, such as on click, on hover, or on drag. After choosing your interaction type, you can see the action to take place has already been specified, like navigating to this different frame. To test your prototype, you can hit the play button in the top right of the toolbar. By adding interactions, you can effectively demonstrate the flow of your design to any stakeholders, or you can test its usability with real users. In addition to a single interaction, you can also have interactive components. To do this, we'll have a few different steps. Number one, create a new component with multiple...